Hello there. I hope many of you enjoyed our question box service this past Sunday. I certainly did. From the um, tough questions such as what's good to eat right now and what birds eat humans to the other questions that ask deeper questions of will the church ever reopen? How are we being changed by this? It was certainly a wonderful service for me to be able to answer some of your questions. I really looked forward to that and enjoyed it. So a well-known secret about me and many other ministers is that Sunday afternoon we take what's known as the preacher's nap. And there's a lot of buildup around a Sunday service, and so Sunday afternoon is just the perfect time for a nap. But seeing as how we're in a pandemic right now, Part of my pandemic care plan is taking as many naps as I can, and so I've been taking a lot of naps these days. But this past Sunday, I was laying down for my preacher's nap, and I received a text from Twinks Hastings, our Director of Lifespan Religious Education. So I'm on a group text thread with Twinks and Karina Stroh, our Admin and Finance Director. And Twinks texts us and says, did you hear that the sandwich board out front of church had been vandalized? Now, many of you know our Black Lives Matter sign was stolen, I don't know, maybe a month or so ago. Jenny Mignoni, our sexton, painted a new one and has that, and that one has been up ever since. So I heard the sandwich board was vandalized and was like, oh, no, not again. What did they do? So Twinks went over to check it out, and Karina and I waited with bated breath to see what they did. And here is what they did. So as you can see, some people had a bit of fun with our sandwich board. Now, in regular times, I am not a fan of vandalism, but vandalism like this, when there were many other words they could have chosen, I actually think is kind of funny. Actually, quite funny. People are having fun. They're finding some mirth. I am totally okay with it. Twinks went over and fixed the sign. Thank you very much, Twinks. Thank you to the first parish member who alerted her that the vandalism had happened. And so my invitation to you today is to go towards joy and towards a little mirth. Not vandalism mirth, but towards a little mirth. And to think about our reactions to things. Cause, because if anything, this pandemic right now is causing us to think, what's really a big deal and what's not that big of a deal? Lick, fart, fart each other, not that big of a deal. Other things, a much bigger deal. This Sunday, staff will be taking the Sunday off to go towards joy, towards a little bit of rest, maybe some naps. And the following Sunday, we will be doing a service on play, on towards going towards joy and all that it encompasses. So I hope that you are able to go towards play and joy and mirth a bit this week, because that is what will help our hearts during this time. Take good care.